Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to today's video. My name is Cynthia and today's video is graciously not sponsored by Amazon, but we are going to be doing a top 25 Amazon purchases of 2021 via my Amazon account. That being said, it's not sponsored by Amazon, but I did actually find out today that they have an affiliate program that you can sign up for. So I signed up for that and actually made all the links that are in the description down below. And if you guys actually click on them and actually purchase stuff, please, please try to keep it associated with my links because it does give me, I think, revenue and revenue is important because I don't want to get kicked off of the affiliate program. I'm really excited for today's video because this is actually the kind of content that I'm really into and the kind of content that I always click on. And fortunately for you, I've cherry picked all the best of the best, according to me, <laughs> and I've provided them all to you in this video. 25 to be exact. There will be five categories in today's video and I have them here. It's going to be beauty, kitchen, home improvement slash organization, health, and miscellaneous. I have all of the items right here. It looks really ugly, but I promise you there's good stuff. So don't go away. Let's go ahead and jump on in. First, we're going to start out with beauty. And the first thing on my list is actually these earrings. So I don't know why I'm talking like that, but these earrings are beautiful. They are chunky gold earrings. I don't think they're real gold, but they haven't tarnished at all. And I bought these quite some time ago. They're super duper chunky if you can't tell. And they've got obviously some texture to them, which is always really nice. And anyways, I love them. They're not heavy. They have a little bit of weight to them to like make them feel nice, but not so much weight that they hurt my ears. But the weight is there, so I do want to forewarn that. Next is another set of earrings that I'm not wearing, but I will gladly model them for you. These are them. They were very cost effective. These are actually very lightweight since they're resin earrings. And the only metal is the gold on the top. And you know what, I'll just leave these on so you can kind of see the difference. These actually have that tortoise look and I like these a lot because in the right light they'll twinkle like you can kind of see right there. And obviously the gold accent on the top is really nice. It's the perfect accent for any other gold jewelry. Also very chunky, very fashionable. Love these a lot. Next, we've got an item that my cousin actually showed me, and this is called Unite 75 Seconds Detangler. This thing is amazing. I have extremely tangly hair, like probably the most tangliest hair of anybody I've ever known, and this gets it out every time. Now, it does have a semi-strong scent, but it's a refreshing scent. So if you don't like scented stuff, you probably won't like this, but if you're good with a fresh scent, this is a thing for you. And especially if you've got tangly hair, this is awesome. It says it's 75 seconds. Like, I don't know if that's how long it takes to tangle, but that's what it's called. This is not as cheap as the other things, but I promise you it's worth it. I still have a lot left and I've had this for several months. So definitely worth it. Next, we've got these invisible acne patches. And these I actually got at a store called Shop Miss A. And that is basically just a dollar beauty store. These were not a dollar though. They have things that range from a dollar to ten dollars, but it's mostly all one dollar. This I believe was nine dollars at the store or ten dollars. On Amazon, I believe it's eight, but you will have seen it already. Anyway, these are amazing. These are the best acne patches that I've ever used. Now I did try the Mighty Patch that is super overpriced in my opinion compared to this because this comes with 84 patches in two different sizes, which you can see on there. And these are actually invisible. The Mighty Patch, if you wear those, your people are gonna clock you real quick with them. Not that it matters to be clocked, but these actually blend in and can look a lot more natural on the skin. And just to kind of show you what they look like, as you can see, there is a dot in the middle and then a thinner layer around the edges, which just allows it to seamlessly blend into your skin. I'm not trying to sell this to you too hard, but it really is amazing and I hope that you give it a try. This conditioner, if you have frizzy, curly hair, is amazing. And it leaves a really, really, really nice scent in the end. It's a little bit strong at first because it has that menthol kind of eucalyptus scent. So it's strong in that aspect, but once you get used to it, and especially once you wash it out, it leaves the most beautiful scent. I always get compliments about how I smell good and I 
I know it's because of this conditioner because I don't wear any perfume. This is by the brand Carol's Daughter and I really don't know what else I could say to recommend this to you, but I do recommend it 10 out of 10. Next, I'm going to show you my used and abused powder puffs. Now, these are actually so amazing and I know that Tati, who owned Tati Beauty, which is now a big controversy and has disappeared, she had something like this in her brand and I ended up just looking these up on Amazon to see if they had something similar and they did. And since her brand is literally gone, this is a great alternative, super cheap and super great. So basically you'll just use this with your translucent powder or like you can see here, I used it with my powdered blush and I'll use this just to add a little bit of touches here and there where there might be patches or whatever, but this is great to use under the eye and it comes with a nice little handle so you can have like good control over it. And before I put blush in my under eye, you basically just do this and just gently put it on. It's got a velvet texture, very poofy, and from what I read in the reviews, you should be able to just pop these in the wash. I don't know about drying them in the dryer, but you can definitely wash these and reuse them. Next, we've got the most amazing moisturizer I have ever used in my entire life. The Neutralize Renewal Complex Blemish Control Anti-Aging Moisture Cream. And it's featuring the word hydrate. This stuff, as weird as it sounds and as goofy as it looks, is amazing. Like I have suffered with flares of bad acne for the past like five or six years now. And this saves me every time. And it's some no name brand. I mean, it's got a name, but some brand that nobody fucking, I didn't mean to cuss. This brand I have never heard of. It kind of gives me like proactive vibes, but I don't know even know how I came across it but I am so grateful I did because this stuff is incredible. It has made my skin feel so soft. It even says that it has time release, AHA, BHA to increase cellular turnover, hydrates firms, and reduces fine lines and wrinkles. I know that everyone's skin is different, but if you haven't found anything that's worked for you, please try this because it worked so well for me and I feel like I've tried everything and I come back to this every single time. There is one thing that pairs beautifully with that product and that is the Eliza Vecca Moisture Hyaluronic Acid Memory Cream. So this I think I saw on a TikTok a very 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 long time ago and a girl was just basically pointing out how it's just super bouncy and like you could poke your finger in it and it'll slowly rise back up. I don't even know if I can effectively hold this here still but you see the effect but yeah I'm sorry now it's rising back up it's plumping itself back to normal Ooh, I'm about to spill it it is awesome there is no moisturizer I've ever used that has left my skin feeling so plump and glowy and soft than this now I know that I said this has been the best moisturizer ever but these two moisturizers are great for different reasons this moisturizer will make my skin feel plump super soft and glowy this one will just straight up take my acne away and my acne scars and then also kind of leave some kind of softness to my skin, but this takes it to another level. So these two together have been my ride or die. This one for about two years now, and then this one for many more. So a couple of the items that I'm going to show you are actually from Mason, things I've gotten for him and he's thoroughly loved. And this is the Bright On Smile Direct Club Teeth Whitening Kit. And this is actually so cute and so cool. But basically it comes with this like retainer looking box. It comes with this LED um, mouth strip. And then it comes with the gel that you apply to your teeth. And it comes with multiple adapters for whatever phone you've got. And you just pop it right in, scroll through TikTok, do what you gotta do. And then once the timer's up, you take it out, put it away, and results basically show ASAP. But yeah, super great really recommend to anybody's loved ones or anybody themselves who desperately need a teeth whitening reliable system buy this next we've got an item that i have seen quite a few youtubers recommend on their channels and i went ahead and bought one myself and this is a basically like a skin ooh, it's wet hold up basically this is a vibrating skin spatula and here is the lid this is what it looks like. It's very dirty. I, this is embarrassing. I should clean this really quick. This is proof that I use it. 
What's unique about this is if you have those little like acne pimple tools that push out your pimples, this is like a refined version of that. In my opinion, this hurts less, but I guess it just depends on what your pain tolerance is like. You basically just hold down this button and it does come with a charger, so it's not battery operated, it recharges. And you just select the option that you want. I always use the Ion Plus. Depending on what you wanna do, you can use this side right here to moisturize and kind of help penetrate that moisturizer to the skin. Or you can use this side, it's facing that way, to kind of press into your pores and really push out whatever's in there. And the thing that makes this work really well is the fact that it vibrates so quickly. Whatever it's doing, somehow it shimmies out the blackheads and works so well. So if I have stubborn blackheads on my nose, which is probably my problem area for blackheads, I'll bust this out and this will work every single time. Anyway, that's literally it. And super thin and sleek, just fits right into your drawer, no problem. Really, really do like this. It's not expensive at all. So if you're interested in cleaning out your pores in a really fun way, I recommend getting this. So the next item is actually gonna be the last item in the beauty category, and that is this Sun UV Nail Lamp. This is for your nail lover. If you're looking to give someone a gift that loves to paint their nails, this is fantastic for that. I know that people typically buy these for gel nails and I do have gel nail polish, but I find myself using my regular like OPI nail polish more often. Anyway, it does expedite the dry time by a lot. So 10 out of 10, recommend this. So now we're going to go ahead and jump into the kitchen category. And in my opinion, I find this to be the most exciting category because I love being in the kitchen. First, we're gonna start with the one and only Scrub Daddy. And when I say the Scrub Daddy, I'm talking about the Scrub Daddy Caddy. And this is actually a Scrub Mommy. This brand has become so popular on TikTok and it's amazing. Like it really is as good as they say and it's totally worth it. I love all of the little things that come with the brand. The fact that you can turn them back in and have them be recycled and they'll give you a credit. They are washable, like you can put them in the dishwasher and wash them if they get really soiled. It has the hot and cold feature where if it's really hot or warm, it will get really soft. If it's cold, it'll be tough. And that's just basically, sorry, I just saw something fly around my face. That's just basically useful depending on what you're cleaning. Anyway, this worked really great for cleaning like my floorboards. When I first moved into my house, I scrubbed out of the floors and areas that were super stubborn. I don't really know how to sell this to you in a way that you know, Scrub Daddy on TikTok hasn't already tried to, but I promise you this is gonna last longer than any sponge you ever own. So next is going to be something that some people might be like, OMG, and most people will probably be like, oh, whatever. And that's basically just my kitchen gloves. They are a little bit dirty because I literally just yanked them off the sink and brought them in here. But basically, I have always had issues with gloves that I bought at Dollar Tree, at HEB, at any local grocery store. They're always super neon colored. They're always tearing on me, just doing the absolute most in the worst way possible. And these have been fantastic. They're aesthetically pleasing. They have this clear sleeve portion. It's pretty long and they do come in the appropriate sizes. So this is a medium and there is some space in here so you can get a smaller size if that's applicable to you but this is perfect for me i hate wearing oversized large gloves and not being able to have control in the sink it also comes with grips it does come in a pack of three and these have lasted me a long time this is still my first pair and they look great so that being said i do recommend these next is something that again is something some people will be like omg and most people will be like that's dumb but next i've got these beautiful spray bottles it features this cute little wood top right here this is where you, what you spin off you can also spin off right here and it has a plastic head and a glass base and then a silicone protection at the bottom so that it doesn't slide around the counter or i guess if you drop it hopefully maybe that'll save the glass a little bit but I've got two of them. One is just for scent and cleaning up quick messes, and this is for grease and grime. And I basically have these because I 
hate how ugly regular bottles are. And when I'm hosting or doing something around the house with other people around, I don't like to have really ugly, cluttered, clanky looking things on my counter. So this just kind of saves me from the grief of having to go in and out of my kitchen uh, cabinet to grab my cleaners. And it just overall looks really nice. I don't know, to each their own. I do really enjoy this. Maybe someone else will too. Next, we got these glass straws and I did not bring the whole set out because that would just be way too much, but it does come with a kinked straw and a straight straw. And these have actually been so cool to have when drinking like iced coffee or just some kind of really refreshing beverage. And basically you can just take a traditional mason jar or whatever glass where you have, you know, just stick it on in and enjoy a nice refreshing beverage without feeling like you're hurting the planet or tasting a metal straw or crumbling some paper on your lips because everybody hates that. Last but not least in the kitchen category are these mini silicone spatulas. Now this actually comes with a set of a bunch of them but I went ahead and brought you the smallest and the largest one that comes in the set and these are so stinking convenient to have because I cannot tell you the amount of times I have purchased a makeup product, a skincare product, a condiment, a jar of something, whatever it is, doodly doodly, anything that comes in a container, I have not been able to reach the bottom until I purchase these. And if you are a bargainer or you love to use things to the last drop, this is the answer to all of your problems. You're welcome. Now that that wraps up the kitchen category, we're gonna go ahead and move on to home improvement slash organization. Next up, we have these beautiful storage containers that I actually just got for Christmas. These I actually ended up asking for because I fell in love with the smaller version, which I currently use for my Q-tips. And I love that the cork is just a ball that sticks right on top of it. Super easy to lift off, grab what you need, and put back on. I don't think it's fully sealed, but it's sealed enough to where no like, silverfish are gonna get in there, hopefully. But it's also very aesthetically pleasing and just cute in general. I'm not entirely sure what I plan to do with these two large ones, but hopefully I figure that out soon because I do love these a lot. Next, we've got this amazing Amazon shoe organizer. Now, I actually love this so much that I bought two of them, and I can tell you that although it is on the pricier end, it is so worth it. For me, I currently don't have enough space to store all of my shoes, so for right now, they're sitting against my wall on the shoe rack, but the beauty of this shoe rack is that it has wheels, and if it's in the way at any point, I can just roll it out of the way. And for me, it's really, really useful. And for, I feel like many others, it would be really useful, especially if you're in an apartment or a college dorm, because of the fact that you can just move it. If it's in the way, you move it. It is amazing, super sturdy, super convenient, and you know, everything that I want and more. So next we've got this garage slash shop light LED fixture thingy majiggy. And while it is kind of ugly in appearance, this thing is the most amazing lighting I have ever purchased ever, with the exception of my ring lights. My garage previously had one light bulb, and that light bulb was obstructed by my garage unit, and I could literally never see anything in my garage. I would always have to pull out my phone flashlight, always have to pull out my little floor light, work light, whatever you call it, just to see around my garage. And as soon as I installed this thing, I never had to pull out my phone again, I never had to pull out my work light again, I could literally see everything. And in fact, one of the most amazing things about this is that it comes with four. So not only do I have one in my garage, I also put two in my attic and attics are dark and they're scary. And this thing lights up the entire thing, no problem. I 10 out of 10 recommend this. Even though it is a little bit higher in the price, I am telling you it is worth every penny. And if you're lucky, there's probably a coupon on it, which there was when I bought it and there is currently right now. So I would get on it, buy it and use it and thank me later. So that wraps up all of the home improvement slash organization category. And we can now move on to the health category. Next, we do have a pricier mouthwash. And I know that I said this about the previous one, but this is so worth the money. 
If you struggle with bad breath or you just hate how bad mouthwash stings, this stuff is incredible. It does sting a little bit, but comparatively to like Listerine or a generic brand, this thing is so much tamer, so much nicer smelling, so much more refreshing, and it doesn't take, in my opinion, as much mouthwash to get the job done. It does say that it has no alcohol, no artificial flavors or colors slash dyes, and it's not burning. That sounds pretty good to me. Next is another life-saving item that I do not use myself, but Mason does. I actually bought this for him, I think two years ago for Christmas, and he has used it nonstop ever since. And that is his Genius Caffeine Tablets. And these come with 100 veggie capsules at 100 milligrams of caffeine each capsule. So if you're a kind of person who struggles with teeth staining from having to drink coffee or tea, or maybe you just don't like coffee or tea, but you really like caffeine, this stuff is amazing for Mason. And one of the things that it features is the lack of a caffeine crash. And according to Mason, he says that that is actually true. He never gets a caffeine crash when he uses these. We go through probably about one of these a month. Next, we've got a percussion gun. Now, I know that percussion guns are all the rage right now, so I don't know that I'm necessarily contributing any valuable information by showing you this, but I'm going to show you anyway. And this is a Mibok, Mibak, Mibok percussion gun, and it comes in this sturdy little bag, as you can see here, and it also comes with this little box to put all the extra attachments in. Now, if you're familiar with Theragun, Theragun is the OG percussion gun, and it does not come with this many heads. So if you are on the market for a very, very good percussion gun that isn't the price of an arm and a leg, I highly recommend this one. Now, I do recognize that the price is over $100 as I'm posting this or recording this, but I was very lucky and actually was able to get this for $40 because it was on like double sale during Black Friday. So I would just keep your eye out for coupons. I think currently it's like $10 off or something like that, but I do frequently see like $40 off or 10% off, 20% off. So if you're patient, I do still recommend this one and just maybe looking out for a good coupon. But I do want to quickly say that one of the greatest things about this is when you have a super long day of walking or of work, whatever the case is, there's nothing more frustrating than having to massage your own feet after a long day or having to ask your significant other to massage your feet after they've had an equally long day. So this is truly the perfect solution for that. I have used this countless times to massage my feet after one of those days and it has worked every single time. But I really do just recommend this overall for really any kind of muscle fatigue, but especially them feet. Now the last health related item is actually a first aid kit. And if you have health insurance and your company provides you with an HSA, which is a health savings account, this is actually HSA eligible and you can purchase this with that money. So if you don't know what an HSA is, probably just Google it. It might not even apply to you at all. It comes with everything that you need here. And if you open it, there is some additional things in the back. And while I think this is a first aid kit to have like in a workplace or at home, I do keep this in the car. And I have actually had to use it a couple times. So you never know, you may definitely need a first aid kit. And if you don't own one, I really do recommend buying one. It's really a safe decision to have a first aid kit available. So that wraps up the health category. And now we can move finally to our last category, miscellaneous. First of the two items in the miscellaneous category is going to be this pop socket. Now, this is actually from the brand pop socket, but it's not a normal looking pop socket. This is actually a clip and I have always loved pop sockets, but my biggest pet peeve when having them is that I couldn't take them off. And I know that the whole point of a pop socket is so that it's like permanently glued to your phone, 
but in my instances, I always liked it for the fact that I could hold it the way I wanted to and like comfortably hold my phone to text or to watch things or even prop it up against things. But when I needed to put it on my car holder or when I needed to have it flushed against something for any reason, I was permanently stuck with this on the back so I couldn't do those things. And then I found this and basically this just clips onto your phone and it stretches so that you know you can maneuver it onto it but it's very sturdy and it does snap pretty tight now if you yank it you can yank it off but it will stay there if you hold your phone move your phone around it's pretty comfortable i wouldn't go holding your phone like this on a roller coaster but i do recommend it if you're having the same issues that i am anyways yeah that's pretty much it it's really convenient i do lose this all the time because i am constantly taking it off and constantly putting it back on but I feel like I honestly can't live without this. I use it just way too much to not recommend it to other people. So if this calls to you, buy it. <sighs> Last but not least, you guys, I have seen so many people talk about this dang game and it's just the, the marketing or the packaging, it just didn't call to me. And then I played this game and I was addicted and a fan for the rest of my life. And that game is Catan. So if you are a person that judges a book by its cover like me, just trust me when I tell you that this game is so freaking fun. It, the best way that I can describe this, and I'm probably gonna get roasted for this by people who are Catan fanatics, but from my perspective, my very humble perspective, I feel like it's like a Monopoly, but more fair and more fun. Monopoly is a very, very long game, and this game can be a very long game, but I feel like Monopoly is painful after like the second hour. Like it's super painful. This game keeps you on the edge of your seat the whole game. It is constantly forcing you to strategize, it's constantly forcing you to think outside the box and really be manipulative and it's it's kind of kind of toxic in a way but in the best ways possible too like it's it really is just the most fun game i have ever played and you do need four people to play it and i think you can only play with four people i don't think you can do three or five unless you purchase the smaller two-player pack or the expansion pack to make this a larger game i personally recommend watching a youtube video on it if you do plan to buy it or if you've seen people play and you want to play with them i would recommend a youtube video over reading the almanac in here because i feel like watching a person play it would make it a lot easier to grasp but yeah, that's pretty much all I'll say on this game. It's super fun. It does come in different kinds of categories or genres. I don't know how to describe it, but this is the basic original one. This is now going to be my number one game that I recommend to anyone that comes over. So yeah, guys, that wraps literally everything up. My phone is currently reading an hour. This has taken me an hour to film, but I know it's not going to be that long when I post it. If my voice has kind of gone out a little bit, I do apologize, but I really, really wanted to get this video out. Like I said in the intro, this is my favorite video to watch, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it too, maybe. And if you really did enjoy it, I hope that you used my links below to purchase any of the items that caught your interest. I do plan to do a monthly video based off of the previous month's Amazon purchases. So if that sounds like something that you're interested in or maybe you're interested in something else, please let me know in the comments down below or direct message me. I am really excited for this series, especially now that I know that there's affiliate links involved. I hope that it all works out and if not, that's okay. I'm just really glad you guys showed up anyway. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.